Hi, today is another lecture of CSS and uh, what, what is this and what do you mean of this lecture? This lecture is about CSS import. At import is of many features in basic to an advanced level and uh, it is also rule of CSS CSS cascade style sheet import means to call any style file okay any function like how to print a paper and which type of features and colors are in CSS okay like uh, colors or features are in CSS which type of and uh, the user how to print that page with color and graphics for whatever and uh, if you open a website like you want to print only this area okay then I can also apply add import feature but in in here basically how to call this okay like uh, uh, as you already discussed about uh, inline style you can also call its inline feature there are two files css2 and css3 and what is the styles of one file is this body and other file is this how to call this using import feature okay then uh, now i am doing it into practical using sublime okay like any new file press ctrl s you save onto a desktop and uh, you can give any file name like import dot html okay now type html function this is what called at import css now first we call link file you have already uh, study about what is link in external style link file it's okay then basically that file name but here is no any file okay now i want to create a new file press ctrl n press ctrl s to save it on a desktop okay css give any file name for example css import one dot css that is file number one css import one okay you can give here the name of that file 
like CSS import one dot CSS extension. This is the file name. Okay. No. I want to create another file okay and that's file is what press control n create another file control s save and here give the file name css import Two dot CSS. Save it. Click save. Two files. Okay, just I am here. Start in line style. Okay. No. Other file name is what? I am calling other file here. At import. That's here is file name. Okay. How it is defined? See here. Our first topic is this link. Okay. If the that file is another drive, you must give a drive name like e drive and folder name. Okay, folder name CSS and file name is what CSS2. CSS at import URL CSS3 dot closed with inverted comma and semicolon is termination end of the statement. that is first file and other is second file okay give any properties like here at import space url and inverted comma closed in the body section you can give uh, h1 adding p paragraph okay any type of you can give here How to do this? Space URL place in motive comma import two dot CSS. No, I am. I'll give here h1 heading it is css import function i'll check it first name of the file import.html this is the this is a very very simple now these functions are not applied why here il not give any properties first you give here any properties then you can apply okay move here this is first and uh, I want to here call body function okay start braces and closed braces body function is what for example color 
you can type here color or background color okay as you according to your choice like here background color okay if body text then color only color if body day if body background then background color it's your choice this is a background color click here you can give here any color for example pink press ctrl s to save and we'll see on a website this is a pink color body means background color and other one is what heading H1. color of the text okay for example see on scroll s this is a c on color okay you can also give another color magenta this is a magenta color and here you can also type here like a font size for example give any pixels 30 pixels that is a font size size of the edit and also you can give text decoration dotted underlined is a text decoration dotted underline you can also here applying padding function okay padding means space like uh, here is a Space again zero pixels, one hundred pixel, one fifty pixel. Control S and see here. This is a padding function. you can see again these are all of the program you can see here what is import like this okay and style this is a one file I'll call here and this is the other one at import URL okay and I'll also give here that the adding okay you can also type here for example this is test import function 
control s here is the body now you you will see here and color is also changed if you change in it on the body if I want to apply here like here color for example I want to here apply here red see this function will apply not apply why because CSS import function follows some rules if I delete it and I'll also delete it and save it also save it then refresh it this program I'll show you here okay we will further discuss in detail next lectures here you must note it here like this program okay css import rule and two files i am importing and uh, body properties and other one is what adding properties if any question about this lecture you will or you can comment below description of this video i'll revert back i'll, I'll revert back as soon as possible thanks for watching